Afternoon. It's a slightly different view today, isn't it? It's also a first video for quite a long time. A lot has happened. An awful lot has happened. We're out of our tiny, tiny, pokey little studio, and we're actually in the production area of our new facility, which is actually it's not ours. It belongs to Picks and Prints, and we get to use it which is quite nice. This is the production facility. We're not open yet. We're still fighting with that thing uh, to, to make it print properly. That's a 24 inch wide format digital printer. And I can see something on the screen that's... Um, if I do that, oh, it's actually, it's that. So if I do that, that's better. There's another printer over there as well for mini lab type work. And over in there, at the moment, you can't get in there because it's full of rubbish and it's a black hole. Well, actually, it's a brown hole. Uh, that will be our studio where we will be able to make beautiful photographs in film and, uh, and the, the dark side. There's been a development also with YouTube. Uh, how long are we going to stay with YouTube? I don't know. YouTube have now terminated our partnership, both for Imagine and Aspire and also Prof Moose's channel. Because, well, they don't like poor people, really. They don't like people without huge numbers of subscribers, you know, at least a thousand subscribers and 10,000 hours of viewing a year or something like that. Uh, if you if you can't do that, then no, we, we don't want to support you. We're, we're for everybody, not not just people who aren't that popular. We're, we're for everybody, so we're not going to support those who aren't that popular. And that's probably just got me banned from YouTube. Um, I'm looking at Vimeo or wherever it's pronounced. Oh, that's a bit posh. Um, I'm looking at funding from Patreon, but... We don't really have the subscribers to make that worthwhile. I mean, Moose doesn't, never mind us. Um, it is a bit of a dilemma. I, I have a huge ethical problem with, I keep getting distracted. There's people, the bus just pulled up outside. I can see right out the front window from here. It'd be a lot better when we get in there. Where was I? Um, apart from being distracted. Yeah, I have a huge ethical problem with with these companies that promise things and say that they're for all and then clearly aren't. It's the risk of being political, it's beginning to sound as if YouTube were run by the UK government. They're, for all means for all, that means that even those of us who don't have hundreds of thousands or millions of subscribers, who don't get over a thousand views in the first five minutes of uploading a video. Some of us don't get that. Uh, I've got friends who I don't think one of their videos, uh, and they've got hundreds, far, far, far more than we have. It's like orders of magnitude more than we have. And I don't think one of them has got a hundred views. But that doesn't make them any less important as a creator, as a content maker. We'll see how things go in here. The advantage of being in here, of course, is I will eventually be paid to be in here. And then we can spend money on new toys. I also get, of course, access to trade accounts, but actually that makes no difference. You'll be interested to know. Um, the markup on this stuff is almost zero. But that's a photographic trade. Firearms trade is apparently the same. Markup mark up on, on firearms trade is almost zero. He says, thinking about yeah some of the discounts I know people have had. Uh, that's about it. That was a short one. Uh, it's testing new computers for a bit of editing as well. And we'll see how things go. We'll see you again soon.